Hey guys, it's Peter, and welcome to my channel, Peter Likes Books. Whoo! Okay, so I literally just sat in front of this computer, you guys. Computer. This camera. This whatever it is. Hi. Unboxing, please. Unpackaging, please. Okay. Anyway, hi. Welcome to my channel, Peter Likes Books. This is Peter. Hi. Welcome to my channel, Peter Likes Books. This is Peter. I'm like fried. Oh, actually, guess what? On my other channel, somebody called me fried. They said, settle down the caffeine. I was like, okay, I guess I will. <laughs> Anyway, so I did another video that's 15 minutes long. It's probably uploading as we speak right now on my computer. So I just sat down in front of this camera for 15 minutes and I talked. You guys, this is craziness, right? And I did a Cramathon 2016 update. But of course, I rambled too long because I do that sometimes. And so when I was done, I didn't have enough time to open this gorgeous package. Or this gorgeous package. <laughs> And I also didn't get to do my shout out. So I wanted to do that. So I just am like, fuck it. I'm doing another video. And you know what? And if it's 15 minutes long, it's 15 minutes long. So first of all, let me open this package because you guys are probably thinking, oh my God, you're getting so many packages. And I am. But here's the deal. I just like to order things online. So this isn't even a, <laughs> this package is not even from anybody, you guys. Ow! Mmm, mother of pearl. I almost cut my finger open. Okay. So anyway, okay, you guys, this is so corny what I ordered. You're going to, I, this is like the ultimate fanboy. Like, who do you think you are? Okay. Do you guys, <laughs> they're so cheesy. They're so cheesy. Okay. Do you guys watch Casey Neistat? He's like my all time favorite YouTuber. Do you guys know who he is? Oh my God. They do not say that on the side. Are you kidding? Okay. So if you go to Casey Neistat, he <laughs> Casey Neistat is this YouTuber that has, like, millions of followers, right? And he does these, like, hilarious videos. So, anyway, he has these uh, Ray-Bans that he wears are, like, demolished. And I was like, oh, my God, I want those so bad. So, I got online and on Etsy, and I was like, they, somebody's got to make these, do you, like, do-it-yourself DIYs, right? So, I ordered them, and look, they came, you guys, in the mail! Oh, my God, how cool are those? And this is what kills me, is it said that they're off-brand, but these truly right here, I'm telling you guys, honest to God's truth, I wish the receipt was in here. These were $17 on Etsy, and look, they say Ray-Ban on the side. I'm sure they're total fakes. But in here on the inside, they say Wayfair. Can you even believe it? Oh my God. And they look totally like his sunglasses. Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Casey Neistat. What's up, dude? Yeah, totally. Anyway, I'm so excited about those. $17. And they even come look in a Ray-Ban package. How cool is that? Anyway, I'm super psyched about that. They're kind of a little bit more demolished than I would want them to be. But whatever. Okay. So then the next thing is, oh my god! So somebody, Melissa, thank you very much, my stumbling heart, comment, com commented, emailed me and was like, I know that you love Rainbow Rowell. Have you read her short story book, Kindred Spirits? And I was like, no, I have not. Excuse me, because, oh, I need some more coffee. Because I think there's only ARCs released in the U.S., and there hasn't been a U.S. release of it yet. Which she informed me, yes, was true, because it was released in the U.K. for World Book Day. So, of course, I didn't have it. And she was like, well, I have an extra copy. Would you like one? Are you kidding me? Of course I would like one. So guess what? Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Okay, so first of all, Melissa. Oh my God! Oh my God, you guys are gonna die. I don't even know how she knows this. Okay, so first of all, she sent me. Did she send me two copies of it? I included an, an extra copy in case your friend Maddie is. Oh my God. Oh my God. That's so sweet. She said, I included an ex extra copy in your, in case your friend Maddie is interested in this short story as well. Melissa. Oh, oh me and Matt, this is what we're going to read in August. I am so excited. You guys. Oh my God. Maddie is going to love that. That was so sweet. Look at that. And then let me, let me tell you what else she included in here. 
And this is actually on my Amazon wish list. I cannot believe it because I people have asked me to like post my Amazon wish list. And I was like, no, because then people will think I'm asking for them to buy me things on Amazon wish list. Which you know I just had that bitter ass fool tell me that I'm jokingly asking people to send me stuff. I'm not joking. Send me stuff. And if I put my Amazon wish list on there, I expect you to buy me things. No, I'm I am joking about that. But anyway, these bookmarks are on my Amazon wish list. And my Amazon wish list is not listed anywhere. Like, you can't find it. So, Melissa, I don't even know how you knew that. I was so, I have one of these so bad, these sprout bookmarks. Do you see them? And I'm sorry, and I'm a really kind person, but I'm not giving one to Maddie. She can go buy her own. So, anyway, <laughs> her mom makes enough money. I am so excited! Oh, my God, Melissa, you totally made my day. Thank you so, so much. So, you guys, I wanted to give a few announcements. Aww. Now I don't want to go on the front porch and have to go read for Cramathon, but I'm really excited because this book right here, Tilt, if you guys have not read, is, like, incredible. I really just want to sit down and actually read this, but I probably should wait. So, anyway, and read it with Maddie. I actually just looked it up and before I opened the package because I, I was like, I can't wait any longer to see on Goodreads what it's about. It's about, um... But this girl waiting in line for the new Star Wars movie? That's all I know about it. So anyway, okay. I wanted to tell you, give you guys some updates, and I also want to give some shout-outs. So I've reached out to some people. I am doing, like, read-along galores, okay? So Ashley, who is, her channel is Ashley Shannon. I should probably post all these below, but I probably won't. I'll try to find them if I can. It's just really late, you guys. It's 12.58 a.m., and I need to be reading for uh, Cramathon. And I have a client tomorrow morning. Okay. So, Ashley Shannon and I are reading the new David Levitt and Nina LaCour book. I thought we were doing it in July. She thought we were doing it in August. I guess we're doing it in August. Okay. So then, um, Shayla at True Reads contacted me. Very nice email. We're very similar in ways, but our reading is totally different. So, we are doing a read-along in August, kind of, okay? We have a really exciting thing that we're going to be doing together. Um, we concocted the whole idea today. I am so pumped about it. You know what I'm talking about, girl. So, anyway, we're not gonna, you will not find out until August 1st. I'm so pumped about it. Okay, and then RJ and RJ Reads and I are going to do a read-along. Um, we're going to we're gonna do a mystery novel. We're going to do that in August, because I've just got too many things going on in July right now. So we're doing that in August. You guys see this over here? Like, these are going to fly off somewhere. I just think that I'm, like, so handy. But, like, I'm the kind of person that they would fly off and, like, stick in my... My dad's a doctor, and he'd be like, I'm not taking the emergency room, so you just put some ice pack on it. And then for the rest of my life, I'd have a hole in my jaw. But anyway... What was I saying? I lose my I, thinking all the time. I just took a shower not too long ago and did my hair, and it just looks horrible. I just need a new hairdo. Tracy Turnblatt, that is a hair don't. Do you know what that's from? That was on TV today, actually. Okay. So, anyway. Yes. You guys, I have totally lost my track. Oh, so that's those are the things that I am doing. Okay. And then RJ Reads and I. Oh, okay. So, here's the thing. I'm giving my shout out for this uh, video. I found this booktuber who named Philippe. And his booktube channel is The YA Reader. All one word, The YA Reader. His Twitter is The YA Reader. His Instagram is The YA Reader. And he is 17 years old, and he's from Brazil, I think. I'm almost 100% sure she, he's from Brazil. And he speaks Portuguese. Uh, his earlier videos, a lot of them are in Portuguese. Um, and But he, his English is really, really good. And he reads mostly YA, obviously, the YA reader. But his videos are, like, really good. And I really like that he gives honest, not bullshit reviews. Like, he did this whole video, and he was talking about, like, David Levithan. And he talked about how he loved Will Grayson, Will Grayson. But he didn't really like um, Boy Meets Boy, which is funny, because most people love Boy Meets Boy. But I kind of didn't really like Boy Meets Boy. And then he says on there that he really didn't like Another Day, and or, uh every day and another day he was like I didn't like those at all which I didn't either and it's funny I was watching I was like our reading tastes are very similar so I contacted him and I was like hey would you like to do a read-along he was like yeah sure go pick look at my goodreads tbr see if there's anything there that you like and uh, it was funny because I went through his tbr on goodreads and it was like every book I had either read or like I wanted to read and he introduced me on his Goodreads TBR to some books that I hadn't even heard of. So I was like, I know I'm reading the highlights of him. So he's a super cool kid, you guys. I mean, he's really nice. 
He loves BookTube. Here's the thing. He's been on BookTube for like three years. And he has like, um, I don't know, six or 700 subscribers. Go give him some love. I want everybody to go subscribe to him. He like consistently has done videos for three years. He participates in every read-along. Like he does like the uh, summer bibliothon, the cramathon, the uh, booktubeathon. He does them all, you guys. He is so active in booktube. That I just want you guys to go give him some love. So, hey, Philippe, it's Peter, uh, and go check out Philippe at the YA Reader. And, like, you know I'm going to be giving some shout-outs in all my videos. I also wanted to say, I talked a little bit yesterday about thumbs down, but today I want to talk something about thumbs up real quick before this video is over, and I know this video is going long. Because I just feel like talking tonight, because I'm bored, and my husband's out, and he's on his way home, he just texted me. So, anyway, um... There are like three or four women, and I don't have all of your names written down, but I meant to, that like immediately respond and give thumbs up to like every one of my videos. And I want you guys to know, I know who you are. You mean the world to me. Every time your name comes up, like Gaia and Anne and oh, who is the other one? Betty. And I mean, there's like three or four of you guys on there that like, you know, Crystal, she always comments on my videos. You know, Jay, he always comments on my videos. He'll be getting a shout out probably for his video channel here in a couple days. You know, I mean, there are some people that always comment on my videos like right away. You guys, I, that does not go missed on me. I absolutely love it. It means so much to me. That's really what I came here for was to, like interact and talk to people about books. And so, you know, it's just like I love sitting down and I like as soon as I see it. Now it's kind of weird. It's like. Especially with, like, Anne. I'm talking right to you right now, Anne, so I hope you appreciate that. Oh, I can't remember who it was. Damn it, I wrote down their name, and now I'm not over there with my pad. But somebody said they sit down in the morning and make coffee and watch my videos. And I'm like, make me a cup of coffee. So you better make me a cup of coffee while you're sitting here watching my video. But anyway, what I was going to say to Anne was this. And you have been my number one biggest fan, fo not fan, I don't have any fans, but you know, biggest follower since I started this channel. You email me, you comment on all my videos, you watch both of my channels, you're super, super sweet. Thank you so much. I mean, you have just really, like on days that I thought, I don't know that I can keep on doing this anymore. You've like really been inspiring to me. So thank you, because I think a lot of times like you guys think like, oh, booktubers get up there and they like make these videos and they don't really care about the person that's reading it. And I think that's bullshit. Like you guys mean the world to me. And when I get comments, I just love it. And, um, you know, even like some people have been kind of constructive with me. Like I've got a couple videos where they've been like, oh, you know, a couple comments where people have been like, hey, like, you know, you should try this or don't like that. I've got so many book recommendations. So, um, yeah, I love the interaction and that's what we're here for, right? I think it's the coolest thing in the entire world. So, and free books. I mean, aren't we here for that, too? <laughs> no, I'm totally joking, you guys. Anyway, I love you. I'm wired. It's Saturday night. I'm going back to Cramathon 2016. Love you. Bye.